The Health and Social Care Programme has enabled us to build on our services that we currently provide for men with prostate cancer. Um, it's an excellent opportunity to re-evaluate what we already do for men with prostate cancer, but also to identify the gaps in service provision. From the back of our, our bid for our project, uh, we were awarded uh, money for a Band 6 clinical nurse specialist. The foundations for her role will be to uh, improve the experience of patients undergoing radical radiotherapy and also setting up a telephone follow-up clinic for patients that are newly discharged from having surgery or brachytherapy. Uh, also uh, we wish to tie in uh, the survivorship initiatives and start health and wellbeing days out in the community settings. We know that patients that have contact with a clinical nurse specialist experience better st higher standards of care and this is something that we're keen uh, to pursue and promote for a wider spectrum of patients. The role of the clinical nurse specialist is extremely important for a man who has been diagnosed with prostate cancer or living with prostate cancer. The other week, uh, three patients who were having radiotherapy came to this department, they had no, no appointment, but they just needed advice. They were having problems with effects from their treatment. And I saw each of them. And very often you don't actually give new treatment, but actually just listening to them and giving them booklets, going through what the side effects can be and simple remedies to try and help them. And that means for the prostate cancer patient that when he leaves here, he feels he's been able to talk to someone, he feels that he's got the advice he needs, he's got the written information he needs. I first met the specialist nurse when I returned for the results of my biopsy. And quite clearly that meeting was a, a challenge um, on both sides because it's not um, it's very easy to deliver good news but when you've got to deliver bad news you, you, you know you've got to deliver it in a sympathetic and understanding manner which is exactly what the way it was done my wife was here and we sat down and the, the nurse explained exactly where we were in terms of what the diagnosis was and she did that in such a way um, such an informed way that it allowed me to um, leave this building in a, in a state of obviously shock, um, but to be able to think through the future and make an informed decision about what treatment I had. And then post-operation, um, she is the only person I've had contact with. First and foremost, I believe that here at Bath there is a um, coordinated team of professionals who are dedicated to delivering a first-class service in terms of this treatment. And critical to that team, again in my opinion, is the role of the specialist nurse. Um, and I found my relationship with the nurse that, 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 that um, was working with me to be exceptionally strong and um, a good deal of trust right from the beginning.